Using Volvo Penta Assisted Docking is a completely new docking experience and can take some time to learn. Here are some important things for you to remember when learning this new possible driving technique. The new driving technique means that you will operate the joystick in constant movements with a steady pressure. The system needs a short while to compensate for wind and current, so a steady movement will give you a better flow. With assisted docking, the boat will not glide when you release the joystick. Anytime you let go, the boat stops with a smooth deceleration and holds the position. Therefore, you should avoid operating in shorter bursts. Now you operate with a constant input by holding the joystick in your wanted direction and then you will slowly move along your intended path. Instead of gliding, it is a controlled movement forward, backward or sideways. There is no need to move fast or with high force. Even if you give a very small input, the boat will start moving if you just hold the joystick still in the wanted direction. Keep it slow and steady. When there is wind working against your movement, you can increase your force with the joystick by pushing it more. You can still build up your force gradually to feel the correct movement. Plan the route in straight lines and give one input at a time. This will allow for smoother operations and letting the system hold one position before you give the next input. For the fine-tuning, remember the tap and twist functionality, where you can move in small increments while holding your position and heading. You can always override or abort the movement by giving a new input with the joystick. Fine-tuning is very efficient in the last steps of docking, when you want to adjust the angle or move a little bit closer to the dock. Assist power is an indicator of force, which is shown in the display and tells you how much the boat needs to work to compensate for wind and current. Note that some angles in relation to wind and current will require more force to keep the position. If you are approaching the higher limits of the assist power, Consider other options, such as an easier angle, a different location, or dockside assistance. Assisted docking is a function to be used in lower speeds with a limit of 2.5 knots. Assisted docking will still be active at higher speeds, but without heading assistance. When you slow down, the system will assist as usual. It is possible to combine using assisted docking and maneuvering without the help of the system. If you twist the joystick while moving it forward or sideways, you have control of the boat's movements without the activation of assisted docking, and the display will indicate this with a grey color. The same applies when you move the joystick diagonally. What's most important to remember is to work steady in straight lines to get the maximum support from assisted docking. To see assisted docking applied in the real docking scenario, see the film titled Assisted Docking in a Full Docking Scenario.